it's so hard now Too many games, it's not the same Just keep it real Hi guys, welcome back to my channel So today I'm bringing you guys a one brand tutorial This is the first of these types of videos on my channel And I am bringing you guys a full face using only Anastasia products You guys already know Anastasia is like my Probably one of my favorite brands If not my favorite brand of all time so yeah, today I'm bringing you guys this look with all Anastasia products. And if you guys would like to see how I got this look, then just keep on watching. To start off this look, obviously I'm going to be going in with my Anastasia Modern Renaissance Palette. It's like one of my go-to favorite palettes. And I'm going to be going in with the color Golden Ochre, this one right here. I'm just going to be picking that up on a blending brush and buffing that all over the crease. So just place it in there. And then... Blend it out in windshield wiper motions. And then when I get to the end of my outer corner, I'm just gonna wing it out. Then I'm gonna be taking the colors Raw Sienna and Burnt Orange, these two right here. And please excuse my nails, I know that they look so bad. I just really want them to grow out, so I'm really trying my best to stay away from acrylics right now. But I'm just going to take that on a smaller brush. I'm going to place those colors on the outer part of my crease, and then also working those into that kind of wing effect we're creating. Taking the color Cypress Umber, this like dark chocolate brown right here, I'm gonna pick up just the tiniest bit of that color. And you guys know Anastasia shadows are like pigmented as fuck, so you have to be super, super careful. I'm just gonna place that the same place where I placed those two colors, like on the outer part. <laughs> Then going back in with raw sienna and burnt orange, I'm just going to take this on a different blending brush and I'm just going to blend everything together and just keep on blending until it looks really seamless. Then I'm going to be taking my Anastasia concealer in the color 1.0 and I'm just going to be using that to cut the crease. And after I cut the crease, I'm going to be setting my lid with this really pretty shade right here. It's called Primavera. going in with a blending brush once again and with absolutely no product on the brush I'm just gonna be making sure once again that everything blends my Anastasia waterproof cream color in the color jet it's basically just a black gel eyeliner and I'm gonna be doing my eyeliner off camera because I know that if I try to do this on camera I'm gonna fuck up the whole look so I'm gonna do my eyeliner and then I'll be right back for lashes I'm gonna be going in with my miss fab beauty lashes they just look like this they're super super pretty not exactly sure what style they are but I'm gonna have them linked down below <laughs> Moving on to the face, I did prime with my go-to primers, my L'Oreal Magic Lumi and my Benefit Professional. These are like my go-to primers. Anastasia does not have any face primers, unfortunately, but as soon as they come out with face primers, you know I'm going to get on that. For foundation, I'm going to be going in with obviously my Anastasia um, Sick Foundation and this is in the color Honey Beige, I believe. <music> For concealer, I'm going to be going in with my Anastasia Banana Highlighting Stick or Foundation Stick or whatever it is, and then also with my Anastasia Concealer in the color 0 0.5. I'm just going to be using this banana shade in any places that I would highlight. 
and I'm gonna be using that concealer under my eyes. face in any places that I highlighted I'm gonna be going in with my Anastasia powder in the color banana contour my face I'm gonna be going in with the Anastasia powder in the color fawn and I'm just going to be using this to carve out my face and contour my entire face. And then to bronze up my face, I'm going to be going in with the Anastasia powder in the color Havana. And I'm just going to take this on a bigger brush and just bronze it. With that same banana powder, I'm going to clean up under my contour. For highlight, I'm going to be going in with my Anastasia highlighting powder in the color Summer. And for a blush, I'm also going to be going in with my go-to blush, which is my Milani Luminoso. And sadly, Anastasia does not have any blushes either. To set the entire face, I'm going to be going in with my Urban Decay All Nighter. For under the eyes, I'm going to be taking those same two colors that we used, Raw Sienna and Burnt Orange. And I'm just going to be running those two colors under my lower lash line. And I'm going to be taking the shade Vermeer, this one right here, and I'm going to be using that to highlight my inner corner and my brow bone. I'm going to be lining my lips with my NYX Suede Lip Pencil in the color Soft Spoken. I'm going to be going in with my Anastasia lip palette. I just got this and I'm super, super excited for it. Um, and with the color number 8, this one right here. And I'm going to be putting a little bit of the color 11. Just a little tiny bit of this in the center to lighten up the lips. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you guys give me a huge thumbs up if you did enjoy it. Leave me a comment down below letting me know what you thought of this look. If you're not subscribed yet, make sure that you go ahead and don't forget to click that subscribe button down there so you don't miss any of my future videos. Also, turn on your notifications so that way you don't miss any of my future videos. And I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys.